Not debatable, Sarah. It is a really nice day out there. <laughs> it's gorgeous. And the weekend, it's going to get a little bit warmer. So feel a fall as we finish off the week. It's beautiful. Clear skies out there as we take a live look at the city of Boston. Temperatures on the cooler side, though. And we've got that wind off of the water out of the northeast. But it's really nice to get out and enjoy even a light jacket or perhaps a sweater. Really fantastic conditions out there. Uh, temperatures right now in the 60s, 66 degrees with that wind out of the east. Dew points in the 40s. So just refreshing crisp air temperatures all around mainly in the 60s a few gusts over 20 have been reported across parts of the coast but overall what we're watching is some warmer air to our west that will work on in this warmer chunk of air behind a warm front and ahead of a cold front that will push eastward through the weekend so high pressure in control today Mostly sunny, highs in the 60s with that east northeasterly wind. Overnight tonight, we fall back into the 50s, a few 40s in the suburbs, a cool night. Some clouds do advance in late with that wind turning now out of the south. So if you're headed to Fenway Park tonight, the Who will be in town. 60 degrees and falling through the 50s. Billy Joel is Saturday night, a little bit milder, a few more clouds, and could see the chance of a shower, especially as the concert goes on. Let me show you. Clouds will be increasing for your Saturday. Sure, we'll see some breaks in the cloud cover, but with warmer air trying to work on in, you'll notice those clouds. As we get into the afternoon, a few showers begin to build in parts of Vermont as well as New Hampshire, and eventually we'll see the risk of some scattered showers over southern New England late Saturday and even into early Sunday now, especially over southeastern Massachusetts. The Cape and Islands may be waking up to damp conditions, while areas to the northwest We'll see the clouds quickly break apart and then temperatures warm up. So watch the change in temperatures. We get into the 70s for your Saturday. Again, more clouds around and really warm on Sunday, a little less humid as temperatures will rebound into the upper 70s, low 80s. I think for the Cape and Islands, you'll stay mainly dry on Saturday with temperatures in the 70s. But by Sunday, you'll see the risk of those morning showers with improvement as we go through the afternoon. If you're headed up to New Hampshire, be aware your best chance of showers will be on Saturday. While we'll see improvement, Improvement Sunday, we'll see clouds breaking apart and sure enough, temperatures into the lower 80s. One other thing we're watching too, away from us, of course, is uh, Tropical Cyclone 9 likely going to become a tropical storm as we go over uh, through the day into the weekend. We do have tropical storm warnings in place for parts of the Bahamas. Now a tropical storm watch for parts of the eastern coast of Florida as the storm is expected to become a tropical storm scooting along the eastern coast of Florida over the weekend. From there we'll have to see what happens but it does look as though it could be tracking out to sea as it becomes a hurricane into next week. As for our forecast next week we'll be watching it closely but right now it looks like as though we could could see some more clouds on Monday, perhaps a chance of a shower. Otherwise, we'll be seeing high pressure build on in, providing bright conditions and temperatures in the 70s. Brianna? All right.